Hello everyone, I'm Roshni. Thank you for joining us today. Uh, my teammate Arpana and I are excited to present our research on semantic search using sentence transformers. So coming to the introduction, as uh, the race digital content grows rapidly, finding most relevant information becomes more and more challenging. Traditional keyword-based search engines, though widely used, have significant limitations. Our research is to use sentence transformers to build a semantic search search engine that understands the context of both queries and documents. And this approach hopefully helps us to ma match based on meanings and not just words. So what exactly are sentence transformers? These are a type of deep learning models designed to generate dense contextual embeddings for sentences and phrases. Unlike other word embeddings that represent individual words without accounting for its structure or the meaning of the sentence, sentence transformers use a pre-trained transformer architecture, which is fine-tuned to capture semantic similarity. By converting both queries and documents into embeddings, we can measure their semantic similarity, and this approach captures the nuances in languages that keyword-based methods might overlook. My teammate is going to expand more on the methodology that we use for our project. Hello. For the methodology of this project, it includes collection of data and data pre-processing and then generating embeddings using uh, both the documents. And then we use the retrieval models to retrieve top five documents and then we compared them and analyze the results. Next slide. The dataset used in this project is a 20 news group dataset. This con contains text from various news groups and they're categorized into the topic. So it has 20 different categories. Next slide. So for text processing, we use the Python's regular expression based cleaning methods. Here we remove the HTML tags and we also remove special characters. We kept only alphanumeric characters and spaces and we also converted text into lowercase. Next slide. The first model we used here is the semantic search methodology. We use sentence transformers to convert the text, both queries and documents into embeddings. These embeddings, they have the semantic meaning of the text. We use the pre-trained model from sentence transformers library, which generates high quality embeddings. And we also use cosine similarity to check the similarity between the query and each document. Next slide. The second model used here is a BM25 search in model. This is a probabilistic model and it only ranks the documents based on TF, IDF, and it ignores any semantic similarity between them. Next slide. For evaluation, we tested both these models using the same query. The semantic search engine gave the documents with related meanings and the context of the query but the BM25 relied only on exact matches. Next slide. The query we've given is AI and ML. You can see both the models results here and BM25 identified documents with keywords directly matching AI and intelligent systems words, and it did not understand any semantic meaning, but semantic search engine effectively captured the broader a uh, context and meaning of the query. Next slide. So the implementation of our semantic search engine with sentence transformers has re revealed that there is significant potential for improving information retrieval within the 20 news groups data set that we've used and uh, that these results showed that the semantic search engine successfully captures the natural language subtleties, delivering more contextually appropriate documents and the recommendations for the user queries. Therefore, this project highlights the benefits of using advanced embedding techniques, and it also opens up avenues for future research to refine and optimize semantic search engines for larger and more complex data sets. Thank you so much.